Water. Water is a very important yet finite resource in rice production. Typically, it takes 4,000 liters of water to produce one kilogram of paddy or 4 million liters for a ton of rice. This is equivalent to the water volume of two Olympic-sized swimming pools. 39% of our farmers' water supply comes from the services provided by the National Irrigation Administration, 20% from rainwater, while the remaining 41% are from spring, communal irrigation systems, fuel-operated pumps, and water impounding projects. With the looming effects of climate change that brings erratic and shorter periods of rain and lesser amounts of rainfall, can our farmers still produce more with less? To adapt on climate change, technologies such as controlled irrigation, drought-resistant and submergence-tolerant varieties, and small farm reservoir are available for our farmers. Controlled irrigation uses the alternate wetting and drying technique to save water during crop growing period. It employs observation well, a tool made from readily available materials to aid farmers when and how much water to irrigate. Drought resistant varieties like RC192 and RC272 are available for rain fed lowland and upland areas. These varieties can withstand limited water supply and are also early maturing. Rice varieties for flood-prone areas are also available. RC194 or Submarino 1 can survive up to 10 days of submergence at its vegetative stage. Farmers can also adopt water harvesting technologies like small farm reservoirs and small water impounding facilities. These will help mitigate effects of rain shortages and can also provide additional income for farmers when used on other farming purposes, like vegetable farming and aquaculture. Know more about water conservation and climate change adaptation. Like us on Facebook or visit our website.